Tutorial video 15 Braced excavation This tutorial video presents how we can create a braced excavation using deep excav. First of all we go to the model tab and we press the add second wall button and here we can see that the second wall is added. If we double click on the right wall here we can define the wall properties. We choose the wall X coordinate to be 20 meters. So the two walls are closer now. Next we will define our wall properties. If we double click on the left wall, we can click here in order to edit the wall section. In this new dialog we can edit the wall sections. In this example we will use sit pile walls. So we click here and we press this button. We will use a sit pile section of AZ25. And we press OK. In addition, we will change the wall depth to 18 meters and we press OK. We double click on the right wall. We can see that the wall section is changed to seat pile and we also change the wall depth to 18 meters and we press OK. Next, we add a new stage. To do so, we press the Add Stage button and here we can see that the new construction stage is added. In this construction stage, we choose to excavate between the two walls to the elevation of minus 3 meters. Next, we add a new stage and we choose to add the strut support. To do so, we we'll go to the toolbar on the left side of the screen and we click this button. First, we click on the left and next on the right wall. In the dialog that appears, we can edit the support properties. We choose the elevation of the support to the elevation of minus 0.3 meters and we press OK. We add a new stage and in this construction stage we choose to excavate between the two walls to the elevation of minus 6 meters. We also change the water elevation and we add a new stage. In this new stage we will add a new support. We click here and we click on the two walls. We choose to place the new strut with the top elevation of minus 3 meters and we press OK. Now we are ready to calculate our model. To do so, we click the Calculate Selected Design Section button here. After the calculation is succeeded, we can see 
the analysis and checking summary page with critical checks and critical values here and if we close it we can see the results on the results tab in this page we can see the wall moment with the moment capacities and we can see the results for every construction stage we can see the wall shear with the shear capacity we can see the wall deflections with minimum and maximum values here again for each construction stage and we can also see the soil stresses Thank you for watching this video. Visit our webpage in order to download a free trial version of our software program and please feel free to contact us.